Good morning, it is Bethany from the Everyday Army Wife and I have a fun video in store for you guys today. We are down, oh my gosh you guys, I'm gonna slaughter this name. <laughs> but I practiced it and it's still gonna come out bad. Okay, so we're at Xiangjiang Shaoryong Bridge. Oh gosh, you guys. Anyways, I'll leave the link down below. You can totally click on it, but this place is gorgeous. It's got a big suspension bridge that we're gonna go over today. And it has, we haven't quite figured it out yet because I'm not quite sure. I got to Google. But it looks like there's like a pepper festival that happens down here often because there's peppers everywhere. So like you'll see peppers along the bridge and um, in town down this way, there's peppers all throughout the town. So I don't know, it's just so pretty. So today we are taking you on a hike with us. Hopefully you guys like the outdoors. This is new for my family. We are not, we have never hardly ever been hiking. So we got ourselves some hiking boots and we are learning to embrace the outdoors and I'm loving it so far. So let's go check it out. Oh my gosh, you guys, the scenery here is just amazing. This is one of the reasons why I love the fact that we homeschool. We are here on a Tuesday. Hardly anybody is here. We have this whole place to ourselves. Look how gorgeous this view is. Like, I love the buildings here. They're so pretty. We, they, they just don't look anything like in the state. And then the overlooks here. We're about to go over the suspension bridge and it's really kind of cute because like I said, it's got peppers and stuff on it. But just look at how breathtaking this view is. This alone was totally worth the drive. I think it took us about an hour and a half to get from Osan down here. but so worth it just look at that so gorgeous so here we are the, the suspension bridge it's really cool it's actually during a weekday so nobody's here look at how cool this is oh it's so fun and like i said it's got a huge pepper on it which i really need to figure out what the pepper is for and they had a statue before we came down towards the bridge that had um a lady with some peppers and like some gardening tools so I don't know it was just really kind of cool but look at this view oh my gosh you guys like how pretty is this so many cute little statues and again peppers oh my gosh you guys I don't know if you can see it up there there's like these mounds those are um those are that's a cemetery isn't that kind of cool hopefully we'll get a little closer I'll I'll have to like splash a picture up of what it looks like for cemeteries here. <laughs> Super fun. It's, I mean, oh my gosh, it's definitely a suspension bridge. It is moving all over. <laughs> so this is cool. We are, we made it over the suspension bridge and we went off to the right hand side and they have tons of little plaques. And I will say it is kind of cool because a lot of it is translated in English so you can actually know what you're looking at without having to get the translator out but check out this it's called a wishing rock and the whole premise is is that you there was a lady who couldn't have a baby she prayed over it for how many years remember years it was a it was a long time <laughs> it was on the plaque but anyway she came and she prayed over this rock and then she ended up having a baby. So anyways, you come up to this rock and people have come and tied their wishes onto the string. Look at this, how cool. Seven years. Seven years, there you go. She prayed for seven years to have a baby. Seven years? So all these people have tied their wishes and prayers and how cool. So here at the wishing rock, they do have a little booth here and they have strips of um, paper and markers to be able to write it on and you can go tie it up so that that's kind of cool okay this is this is me real in the moment very severely winded we totally just climbed this side of the mountain but totally worth it we didn't actually go all the way to the top we stopped at it looks like the landing right before um we have kids that are five and seven between the four boys and this was a lot like you can see over my shoulder it's a good it's a good way down and gosh you guys i can't even like really show you it doesn't come across very well but these stairs are seriously like straight up 
like it is just like straight up the side of the mountain and you're doing that the whole way up until you get here so it's really cool we're getting ready to kind of go back across the suspension bridge they have a little um like a little shop center there that's got some snacks and some treats and goodies and stuff so we're gonna go yeah we're gonna do that we're gonna go hit that up next you could easily you could easily do this with a stroller if you stay on the main area around the lake but it's still definitely definitely worth driving out to see so at the end once you come over the suspension bridge there is a map here and the suspension bridge is number eight on the far end but you have all these trails that you can do on the side of the mountain. Okay, so you start your hike at this um, little shop place. You, could, you start and end here. So we bribed the kids and we went up on the hike and now we're gonna come down here. They have like all sorts of things. You can actually, you could eat here, but they have drinks and ice cream and snacks. If you want to check out my other videos, I have videos on the Osan area and walkthroughs of apartments if you're house hunting and then we have a couple of fun things that we've done while we were here in South Korea So don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you get notified when a new video goes up